So get regarding. We'll see. So what is this pseudo user, guys? Actually, root user is administrator of Linux system, right? Administrator of Linux is an administrator. Also called as super user. Super user. Super user. Okay. Also called as super user. So what is the meaning of super user? The user which is having uh, all privileges right? is administrator of Linux system. Okay, administrator. Administrator is a super user. Okay, so the super user means has a uh, all the privileges. Like you say, if you take a Oracle, you take a Oracle uh, 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 SQL uh, database server, you got uh, some super user server there, like a system, sys, uh, sys DBA, like this, certain roles are there. SysDBA is a, a admin role. Okay, system sys one more is there. That is okay. There are a, a account, but uh, is like a super user type accounts only. Okay, next normal user like a, you take a user one is a standard user plus privileges. Okay, now. Here it is. I have a user. So I'm minimizing this one. So I'm minimizing that one. And I'm going to another putty session uh, for a student uh, 13. Okay. So students 13A admin at the rate 1, 2, 3. Sorry. Student 13A password is same, right? So clear. Uh, the text size is small, so I'm going to change settings. Appearance, so I will put a text as 24 for a more clarity. Guys, for this practical, we need a two windows or a two things. At least one is normal user account next one is a uh, root account is also required both are required okay so compulsory look at what i'm doing okay so guys i'm started no one is giving any sign or a thing you're there right yes sir yes yes sorry so look at this one last time someone is asked uh, sir a user can able to create another user user can delete another user kind of stuff similar same thing same thing about what we are doing this is a normal user want to create a user user add user add user one what it is showing permission denied permission denied means normal user cannot add a user Okay, no problem. So I want to change password for what it is showing. Only root user can specify a username. So you can run the pass wd command, but you cannot change the password for other user. If you put pass wd, works. You are changing password for yourself only. You are changing password for yourself only. Control C. You can change your password for yourself, but you cannot change password for others. You can add, a, you cannot add users. You cannot modify the users. You cannot modify the users. You cannot change the group or a, a, a permission, group permissions, ownerships, group ownerships, ownerships. Uh, other users files permissions like that the normal user don't have a permission okay so this is a look at here guys so this is my system my system contains administrator administrator do things right but sometimes if some different user like a standard user want to do a standard user
us to do a admin work or you can say um, run admin command okay. user cannot okay. so cannot run so user cannot run cannot do that one okay so what to do guys i want to add a user or i want to change the password so i have to go to root user right so what i'm going to do is this is my student account so i'm switching to root how to switch to root from the normal account how to switch to root from this terminal only in this look at this one only as yes, you iphone means you, you are switching to the uh, root user with the root user once you are switching you will get a pwd is root users home directory okay along with the home directory along with the home directory like this so give the password switch to root directory now i am root now i want to change the password m a n c m a n c Okay, the user is not, uh, it is showing it is not there. So just I will try once. Uh, you, okay, user add, user add, user one. Okay, home directory already exists. Not copy file from scale it today exit. So I will check once again why this is. Yeah, tail iPhone three or iPhone five. Slash it is slash pass the video. Okay, so user one, yeah, user one is uh, given. Let's use space hyphen user one. Pwd, yeah, it is good. So I I went to user one for checking purpose. Pass wd user one. Okay, user one. User one. Very good. See. What I what I want to do it with the student? I done with the root. Good now. Now exit. Put a clear. Put a clear. So what I done? So what I want to do with the uh, student? I done with the root. Now you back to the student. This is scenario. This scenario completed. So I want to. Add a user, and I want to change the password for a user. That is a task. I switch to root, and I change. I created a user. I change the password. I, I created a user. I change the password. Guys, understand right? What I done? I went to root. I done the work. Completed or not? Yes, sir. Very okay. Now the problem. You don't know root user password. Then what to do? Okay. To do admin task. What to do? Switch to root user. And uh, complete the task. Okay. How to switch? Yes, space hyphen and give the password. Okay. Do your task. Then once it is completed, exit. So this is we are doing it. Okay. The question is, if you don't know. root user password what to do okay so then it is come to sudo okay use sudo okay what is sudo do as super user don't forget guys 
do as a so for user is similarly in windows in windows run as administrator okay run as a administrator like i want to run an application i am a standard user i cannot open it i can't able to open a disk management i can't able to open a uh, user management service management related in a windows right so what i do right click and run as a administrator right click run as a administrator run as a administrator similarly here it is sudo for example i am a normal user i am a normal user i am a user one for example notes is different uh, um, what we do is different guys compulsory i am a user one standard user i want to run a command so admin command so sudo uh, user user add user to sudo password user to sudo admin commands right uh, ch mod kind of stuff right so what you do put a sudo before your complete command so this is do as a so for user like this so i am trying to do the do kind of stuff i want to create a user to sudo yeah guys uh, it will may display as uh, some lines so these three lines for you only user add user to see so beautiful three lines are there we trust you have a receive a, a usual lecture from the local system administrator it usually boil down the three things respect the privacy of others think before you type i like this third one with great power comes with great responsibilities and is asking a password for a student 13a okay not root user also you don't know the root user and you want to run a admin command with a sudo means do as a super user type like run as a administrator but you are not able to do it why because of like this you are not a sudo you are you are not a sudo you are. okay you cannot run so with great power comes with a great responsibility it is giving password so it is showing student 13a is not a sudo your file this incident will be reported so be careful when you are doing it okay you are not a sudo your so this is very important the last line is very important not, not everything okay great power comes great responsibilities so the sentence where do you hear the sentence where do you hear that sentence great power comes with a great responsibilities okay very good spider man Hmm. Not homecoming thing. First, 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 Spiderman. Okay, guys, is a not a sudo here. So how to make a user as sudo here? Yes. Okay, how to make a user as a sudo here? Yes. Look at guys, few things we have to do it. First thing. Add user to wheel group. If you want, you can put a in a, in a supplementary. Group. 
if you want otherwise primary group okay secondary group or a supplementary group uh, i will check it once again the spelling so secondary group i put a secondary is better okay so add a group to two. second okay edit sudo your file it's your file you have to remove hash that uh, percentage wheels two statements are there okay so compulsory two uh, statements on both statements you have to remove it so find out where is sudo your file and then we have to uh, remove it so like that you will get it okay so how to do it this cannot be edited by normal user we need a root okay so compulsory root user login with the root user and we have to do these two things okay what is the first step add user to wheel group guys i already login with the root here i have a root okay so first one i want to add a my student 13a to wheel group already this is there so i want to add a this user is already in a one group primary group is this one so i want to add student 13a to wheel group as a secondary group tell me the comment user you want to add a user to a group that is supplementary group or a secondary group first of all how to add a user to group existing user to a group i think yesterday only we discussed that one guys how to modify user at least tell me how to what is the command for modifying user user mod user mod mod okay so which user i want to modify user 13a what i want to do it i want to add the user to wheel group okay i want to add it i want to add a user to wheel group as a secondary or a supplementary group it means hyphen capital z it means hyphen capital z sometimes guys <clears throat> uh, you verified we don't have uh, any supplementary groups here it is a only primary group is there only one group means primary group is there we don't have a supplementary group but sometimes sometimes user can be in a multiple supplementary groups one primary more than one supplementary groups are there one or no supplementary or zero or more zero or more uh, supplementary groups user can be there one primary is compulsory so if in case a user is in a multiple supplementary groups use append hyphen a hyphen a if in case a user is in multiple uh, supplementary groups if you don't use now also no problem because it's not having any supplementary groups or a secondary groups done again check it so you can see it is added to wheel group you can see it is added to wheel group earlier not there it's a only one group that is a primary group now it is showing a it is a supplementary group okay so this is about your how to add a user first step this is the first step the first one first verify user identity where whether is in already in a uh, group or not like that uh, next one is add a user to the group 
why wheel group it is not compulsory uh, like that you should uh, add the user to the wheel group like that okay it is not compulsory it is next edit sudo your file so where is this sudo your file vi slash etc slash sudo ers file guys you can use vi editor or nano editor also no problem okay so i'm going like this slash etc sudo ers next okay it is a very big file actually our lines are in a last so i'm going to last how to go to last or otherwise i want to search it tell me how to search colon slash i want to search wheel group right wheel i want to search wheel now i directly went see how much it is very easy if you see the first line don't have a hashtag but second line having a hashtag second line having a hashtag so remove that hashtag also the first one yellow people in a group wheel to run all comments yellow people in the group wheel the people in the wheel group can run all comments so the meaning is people in the group run all the comments okay something same thing without a password so if you remove this hashtag it means it, it won't ask you a password so you must give the password to do that one like that it is a read only file no problem insert yeah already i removed it so um, right very good okay it is a read only file okay so i removed this hashtag also so what i'm going to do is first i copy these two lines paste here so i want to be vi editor slash etc slash sudo ers find out so many lines go to this line here is that hashtag is there already like this hashtag is there remove this hashtag also so this is already no hashtag so good no hashtag here so here is a hashtag remove the hashtag it won't ask you password if you uh, remove this hashtag you know hashtag in the configuration file meaning is comment hashtag means comment the comment won't run right so like that now i want to save this file escape colon wq escape colon wq configuration is done it is asking it is a read only file how to overwrite how to overwrite escape colon wq with a exclamatory mark you can overwrite exclamatory mark now it is done it is done now your user is sudo user your user is sudo user first two step completed your user is sudo user so what i'm going to do is i'm going back to my user like this okay now again try once again it is asking password it should not ask a password it is asking a password so i am putting control c it should not ask a password so what i'm going to do is uh, i'm going to re 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 put a setting okay so just like exit and uh, enter kind of stuff this is reset a terminal then for to new session um load uh it may require a, sometimes it may require a login logout kind of stuff okay so when i uh, first of all i want to exit from here so logout and login is always very better okay okay 
so log in log out so then the, it will load all the uh, kind of set settings okay uh, it is already understand but sometimes the configuration settings also it should load no? so like that so what is our last command adding a user to sudo add user to add it add it <laughs> okay and also sudo pass wd user to yes user to user to create a id user to create user to is created you can check with a uh, uh, slash etc slash pass wd file also user to is created I put a name is Manasi, so that's the ball. Okay, thank you. you want to change the password for a Manasi? Pass WD MA NASI. Why it is so? What is the problem? You should put as do as a sofa user. Put it. Okay, when it's successful, yeah, the name is different. So, Mansi different name is uh, M A N S I, right? A is not there. A is there. In this my in my list, it is not there. In this one, A is not there. Okay, no problem. That's it. So user modification also we can able to do it. You guys understand what is this sudo kind of stuff? Sudo means do as a yes, soap sir. user. Okay, do as a soap user. Normal user can able to run admin commands. Normal user can able to run admin commands. Okay, okay so. don't know root user password okay the important thing is here it is normal or a standard users can admin commands by using sudo Okay, so sudo means do as a super user in the windows. We have run as an administrator. Okay, so when you are going with the user, you put a sudo command, it will scold. It will scold you. And uh, also it asks for a password and you are not a sudo user. So, so make a user as a sudo user. How to make it? First login with the root. Okay, go to root. In a root can able to do it. So first add a user to build group. Okay, as a secondary group is preferable. Edit sudo users file. So what is a sudo users file? It is slash etc slash sudo ers. Okay, so what to do? Remove the hashtag at a percentage wheel. So usually two statements are there, percentage wheel statements. You have to already one, first one is already hashtag is removed. So second one is uh, you have to remove it. Okay. And next, uh, this is the steps I taken. So this is I added and verified. This is second one, editing the file. So this is the first one. Okay. This is the first one, first step. And this is the second step. We done. Okay. So what to do? Log out. user logout user again login login logout the user and login and uh, run of type sudo uh, user add user to okay and pass sudo 
pass wd user to okay, do all these things like uh, type id uh, user to like this okay so this is how to run it guys understand or not yes sir okay the next part we will go to chgrp ch1 so we'll see that one and the disk management chgrp because last time also they asking these questions okay do as a super user that is also very important in a administration 